Talking to Coach Jim Bonds, who's St. Francis Golden Knights moved to 7-0 and with a huge 2013 victory over Salesian. Late touchdown, defensive stand. Coach, how excited are you, and what did you guys do well tonight? Uh, really excited for our team, uh, first of all, to be 7-0, uh, 2-0 in the league. That's a really good Salesian team that we just beat. Um, you know, they're, they're uh, I think, what were they, 5-1 and one coming in with uh, their only loss coming against Calabasas. So we knew we had our hands full. And uh, it was a 48-minute game, you know, like we've had several of uh, those already this year. So, um, you know, we, we played bend but don't break defense when we had to, and we were able to, to uh, you know, get two touchdowns and two field goals to get 20 points on the board. So just, you know, really proud of everybody. I thought our special teams, though, especially uh, played great tonight. Well, I was just going to mention, nobody had amazing stats, but so many different people did little parts to win this game. Matthews on defense, the big touchdown. You had Gasmarian blocking an extra point and the pick. Uh, Dulles Hanelock kicking every ball out of the end zone and his two field goals. How important are just those little plays that people don't see in a stat book? They're, they're very important. You know, and you mentioned, I think, all of them, you know, just the uh, the touchbacks on the kickoffs, making them go 80, you know, and they get frustrated. You know, they have some talented kids back there returning kicks, and uh, when it's the fourth or fifth time of the night and you don't get a chance to return a kickoff, that they start getting frustrated. And then, uh, you know, our punter, we punted the ball out of bounds on purpose so that they didn't have a chance to, to return a, a punt. Matt Bezerovich did a great job. Uh, Dulles on the field goals, I think, I think one was like a 47-yarder. Yeah. Um, and he was just pure right down the yeah. middle. So uh, he had a great night. So now you got three road games to close out the regular season. What's going to be different for this uh, preparation in terms of, I mean, I know it's just another game, but what's different for the three road games? Are you looking at any differently? No, we, we're a one week at a time approach right now. And as I told our team, you know, we, we uh, the last, uh, I don't want to say, you know, easy game because that's uh, not true but you know the last lopsided score we had was in week two and uh, from week three on they've been barn burners battles battles to the to the last minute and that's how it is in the Angeles League we know each other well uh, we've been playing Harvard Westlake for a long time that's next week's opponent and we need to have a great week of preparation and, and uh, go on the road and try to beat those guys and what are you most proud of tonight I'm just proud of our will, you know, as a team, just that we did not give up and that we kept fighting and fighting and You guys fighting. always seem to find a way to win, too. Yeah, and that's, you know, when, you know, we've had teams in the past where, you know, we uh, we would lose the close games, and it seems like this year we're finding a way to win the close games, and uh, that says a lot about the character of these young men.